Welcome to DCS Freelancing Virtual Assistant. We'll show you about what is e-commerce, what is an e-commerce virtual assistant, what will be your role as an e-commerce VA, what are the common tasks, qualifications, technical requirements, rates, and where to apply. Welcome to my YouTube channel. My Please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell to be notified when I post a new article about freelancing virtual assistance tips. Electronic commerce is the buying and selling of goods and services or the transmitting of funds or data over an electronic network, primarily the internet. These business transactions occur either as business to business or B2B, business to consumer or B2C, consumer to consumer or consumer to business basically e-commerce is all about buying and selling goods over the internet there are clients from the US UK Canada or other parts of the world who have their online stores like on Amazon eBay Facebook marketplace Etsy and some more online business stores an e-commerce of VA will work as per the clients business need and will do the needful to keep the online store running 24-7. What are the tasks of an e-commerce virtual assistant? An e-commerce virtual assistant or VA can do the following tasks. Product research and listing. The placing of products in the list at Amazon, eBay, Facebook Marketplace, etc. website according to the specifications of products like color, shape, size, price, etc. to make it more convenient for the customers while shopping at these websites. Product image editing refers to modifying or improving digital or traditional photographic images using different techniques, tools, or software. The prime target of any e-commerce online seller is to get a better deal to get a better profit. The eye-catching and appealing photos of the products that they are selling online can draw the consumer's attention that can increase sales uh, per day. The product image editing service ensures a greater traffic in online stores or website and increases immediate sales. Product Leads Optimization It is the process of upgrading products' pages to improve their search visibility and finally generate more sales. This process includes keyword research, searching engine optimization, optimizing listing text and image content, and increasing the number of reviews. Managing pricing and inventory. The system involves decisions of pricing and inventory management with the goal of maximizing profit, which in equals the sales revenue minus the purchase and inventory costs. This is where you check the available stock and make sure that the inventory of the products is always updated in your client's store. So fulfilling orders. Order fulfillment is the process of receiving goods, then processing and delivering orders to customers. The process starts with a customer placing an order and ends once they receive it. However, if the buyer wants to return a product, order fulfillment manages the return transaction as well. We also have order fulfillment. So, of course, for an e-commerce business, clients are shipping out orders. You always need to check and make sure that orders are shipped out in a timely manner. Processing returns and exchanges. In retail, a product return is the process of a customer taking previously purchased merchandise back to the retailer and in turn receiving a refund in the original form of payment, exchange for another item, identical or different, or store credit. You also need to handle the return, exchange, and refund request. In our DCS program, it includes there on how to respond to the customer without losing them. So when you enrolled in our programs, 
you can learn the customer services scripts. Handling customer support. It is the range of services you offer to help your customers get the most out of your product and to resolve their problems like answering customer questions, uh, providing assistance with onboarding, troubleshooting, and upgrading customers to a new product or service. As an e-commerce VA, you, must, you will be assigned to attend to customers' requests and inquiries either through email or chat or phone calls. If you have an experience of customer service either in BPO or administrative job, it will be a great advantage for you. There will be customers who will contact the company about their orders or requests, uh, refunds, replacements, and other related issues. You need to handle those customers. We have some clients that are looking for a virtual assistant to handle on their customers. In addition to this, there are some clients who will also require you to handle social media management tasks. Say, for example, your client company has an account with IG or Facebook uh, account. It is also possible for you to be assigned to create engaging posts and to attend to cost, uh, comments and messages. In, so. We include this skill in our freelancing virtual assistant program under SMM Lesson Basic. If you are interested to learn, you can join us and learn the basic SMM skill. What are the qualifications? An e-commerce virtual assistant must at least be knowledgeable on product research and listing and e-commerce tools. These are important for searching good products, handling order, and inventory. In addition to this, an e-commerce virtual assistant must know how to use different software to be used for product research and listing. So make sure you acquire and your knowledge about using different types of software. But you can still highlight on your application that even though you don't have experience with those, you can still learn it in the most efficient and fastest way. You can highlight with your client that even though you don't have any experience, you are still capable of learning the tools and be an effective e-commerce uh, virtual assistant. If you enroll in our programs, you are going to use our paid uh, software for you to apply on what you have learned from those programs. You are going to watch the video lessons on our website and do the actual training using our paid uh, software. What is the equipment needed? For technical requirements, you need to have your own laptop or PC and reliable internet connection. A3 Mbps download and upload speed will be reasonable enough. For laptop or PC specs, so far for e-commerce or VA jobs, some of them require an i3 processor and up with at least 4 GB RAM. Some other clients do not require any laptop or PC specs. As long as you have your own laptop or PC, you are fine. Where to apply? You can use onlinejobs.ph and Upwork. There are also a lot of clients who are looking for e-commerce VAs in these uh, websites. Uh, also, you can directly apply on Facebook group or an agencies who are looking for an e-commerce uh, virtual assistant. There what is the rate? The possible rate of an e-commerce VA is ranging from 3 to 8 US dollar an hour. If you are a newbie, you might get an offer of around 3 to 4 US dollar an hour, but there are clients who are actually offer a higher rate even for newbies. If you are new to freelancing, just be patient and you will find the best client right for you.
If you want to learn the e-commerce and the basic of freelancing VAs and social media management, you can find the link below on how to join our program. We provide training for Amazon arbitrage dropshipping, eBay, Facebook marketplace dropshipping, and freelancing virtual assistant. We teach people to learn about e-commerce and freelancing jobs to become professional virtual assistants. Then, we help our students as they apply and earn from home. Our apprenticeship program is where you will watch a video tutorials and then you will do the actual training using our paid tools to enhance your skills with direct coaching and guidance. Also, we offer a virtual assistance as services to online sellers for Amazon, Arbitrage and Dropshipping, eBay, Etsy, Facebook Marketplace, Dropshipping, and Freelancing Virtual Assistant. We will be glad to help you to become a successful virtual assistant and work in the comfort of your home. That's all and thank you for watching this video.